Hey guys, this is Chris Vincent out here at JMAT RV in Poto, Oklahoma. I want to show you a video today. Uh, I'm standing in front of one of our brand new Montana 3921 FB. This is that new front bath floor plan that everybody's talking about. Uh, when we go inside, I'll show you what makes this one so unique and so special. Uh, but we're going to go around to the outside and the inside and so, show you some of the high points of this camper trailer. Right off the bat, up here at the front, we got the little, uh, kind of I call them show off lights when you're at your park or campground. You can see these little orange lights. Uh, you can tell your camper uh, from, from any spot. Makes that real easy to, uh, to pick your camper out. Also, you notice we do have the uh, automobile glass front uh, window up here in this cap. Now that's 80% tint. Uh, very hard to see inside there. But when you get inside, it uh, gives you a nice kind of uh, view from, from uh, the, the front of this coach. Uh, right here at the hitch pin, we do have the, the mole ride hitch. That's going to keep that, uh, the camper um, from, uh, it's like a shock absorber. It's going to keep your truck from taking too much uh, brunt of the bumps and everything going down the road and also the camper. So it's going to really smooth that out. Around here on this side, we have our uh, convenience center. And this is pretty neat. Uh, right here, we do have a kind of a one-stop place for all of your hookups. Uh, so you can see your black tank, gray tank handles here. We have our low point drains. Uh, we have a winterization system here, makes it easier to pump in antifreeze uh, if you want to winterize. It's got black tank flush. Uh, so if you want to uh, clean out your black tank, uh, it makes it really easy to clean out that black tank. Uh, of course, your regular uh, city water connections, battery disconnect. So if you're storing the camper, you can disconnect this battery so it, uh, the, the camper doesn't run your battery down. Even has a hot and cold, here's the hose for it, but a hot and cold outdoor shower right here. And then all your cable and satellite hookups to the different locations in there. So everything's just right here in one convenient place. Uh, also over here on this corner, uh, this is the control panel here for our auto leveling system. Uh, so basically when you get, your, get the camper off of your truck, this big auto level button here, you just hit it. And this does have six point hydraulic auto leveling. They'll go down and they'll just auto level the camper for you. Makes that really convenient. I do want to show you something on the very back end on this particular trailer. Uh, this Montana has the legacy package on it. And so back here in the corner, uh, you've got your uh, power cord here but you have a uh, you have a crank motor so you hit this little button here and that'll pull that cord in or you hit it and it pulls the cord out so these are really heavy uh, kind of cumbersome cords so that makes that really convenient and gives you a nice kind of storage place for it um, while we're back here one other thing uh, with the legacy package we get the full back cap here and if you look up there in the middle we do have the reverse camera so this has a uh, uh, LED display that goes into your pickup and plugs into the cigarette lighter and your camera's right up there And so when you're backing up, you can see uh, what's going on behind you All right, well, let's uh, run over on the other side and look over there Okay guys now we're on the other side of the camping trailer uh, We've got uh, two of these 30 pound uh, propane bottles one on either side makes that real convenient to get to I do want to show you this storage. This has a huge storage uh, right past the the door, the frame actually drops down. It's called a drop frame um, um, uh, system. So what that does is that really opens this up and gives you a ton of space in here to take whatever you want, lawn chairs, uh, just about anything you want to take, you can fit, fit it in here. Uh, also, we have a, a central vacuum system. Uh, you can use it inside. You can also use it outside. So right here is where you can access that. So you can pull your truck up next to the camping trailer and actually vacuum out your truck if you want to. Uh, another thing, this is kind of climate controlled. There's actually uh, a system here, the furnace and the ducts are right there. So this is gonna, if your furnace is going, that's gonna help keep this uh, a little bit warmer here in this compartment. So whatever you put in here is gonna be better protected in cold weather. Uh, looking up, we do have our outdoor marine grade speakers and uh, awning lights that are always all, already on it. Now this awning, this is actually a double awning system. If you look down, the slide has its own awning. And so these are electric awnings and uh, two sets of awning lights. So really the whole camper is nothing but a big awning. So quite a bit of shade uh, when, you're out, uh, when you're out camping. 
makes that really nice. Uh, the, the slam latch baggage doors have magnets on them, so instead of having the clips that you can break off, magnets will hold that up there, which is really neat. Now this camper is a front bath, and when we get in there, I'll show you why this is needed, but this is one of the uh, first tankless water heater systems I've seen. So this is a tankless water heater. You get your hot water on demand, so a really neat system there. Uh, coming down, we do have the Mulride steps. Now these are, this is a four step entry. They go all the way to the ground, so that makes that very, very, very sturdy. So a really upgraded system there, a lot nicer than uh, the old steps they used to do. All the Montanas also come with this little outdoor TV, so take your awning out. You're already hooked up and you can uh, watch the ball game or whatever you want to out outside here. Uh, well, let's run inside and look in there. Okay guys, now we're on the inside. This is a rear living uh, camping trailer back here in the back end. So we have our two recliners here. Uh, we have our big sofa in the back. One neat thing about these recliners I do want to show you. Number one, you got your little lights here for your cup holders. Uh, so just so you can see better. But one of the really neat things here is this is an electric. So I can just hit the button and these will recline or, uh, or come back in just at the touch of a button. So a really neat system there. Uh, that is a really large uh, sofa in the back. This will make a, a bed. It's bigger than a queen size bed. Uh, let me show you how that works real quick. And it's just that simple. Uh, really makes a large bed, easy to make out. And this right here, the black part, this is actually memory foam, so it's a very, very comfortable bed. Let me put it back up. Okay, another nice thing I really like about this is you do have the end tables with the plug-ins on either side, so a place to put your remote or your drinks or whatever you need. This camper has LED lights throughout. They have accent lights everywhere, so you got the little accent lights up here in this uh, crown molding. Also, even accent lights right up here above the uh, island sink, so uh, just a really pretty trailer when, when you get all the lights on. Right here is our large LED screen TV. This will pull out an angle for whoever needs to see it. Right above, we do have our all-in-one entertainment center. Now this is a radio, it's a CD player, it's a DVD player. You can plug your iPhone or iPad into it and play music. It even has Bluetooth. And if you remember, we got speakers outside and inside, so it's pretty much a one-stop shop for everything you need, any kind of entertainment system you need. You get your dip, deep rich sound in here through the sound bar below the TV. And then below that we have our electric fireplace. Now this is really neat. Right now it's summertime so we don't have this going. So it's just kind of for looks. So you can use that in the summer just for the kind of the effect of it. But when it gets uh, cooler, this is a space heater and it will warm up this bottom area. So saves you a lot of propane. So let's say it's 40, 50 degrees in here. You don't have to turn on your furnace. You can turn that on and that'll keep it, keep it pretty warm in here. Uh, right here, we do have an extra large pantry. So pretty much any kind of food you want to take, you got plenty of room there to take it. So not only that for food storage, we have this Samson residential refrigerator that does have the ice maker. So Again, just about any kind of storage you want, you can take. And then right here, even more storage. Now, you can notice how deep that is. If you want, back in behind there are the connections for a washer dryer. So you can actually do a stackable washer dryer and that, that would be located right here. But if you didn't need it, that's just even more storage. So quite a bit of storage in this camping trailer. Uh, this has the new oven system. This is a self-igniting bottom oven so you don't have to reach down here and reach back and light that pilot it will light itself it also has the uh, spark ignite on the top and it's battery operated so just hit the button and it lights itself on the top too so really really neat idea there extra large microwave now this is a convection oven microwave also so this will brown if you need it to and uh, just drawers and storage all over this uh, the all over the island too. Now this island does have hard surface countertop and it's got this flush mount sink and this is a 50-50 stainless steel sink and it does have the pull out 
high rise faucet, which is really nice. On the dining table, it doesn't have the little post down below, so you're not hitting your legs on, everybody's not hitting their legs on that middle post. And if you need it to, it can extend out and uh, even extend out further. So you can really get that table out uh, far if you need it to, or that'll go back in and just as easy slide back into normal. Now these chairs here, there's two of the chairs will fold up out of the way. A lot of times people don't need four chairs, so you can just fold up two and store them wherever you need. The other chairs are normal and they do have storage in them, so if you need to card games, placemats, whatever you want to, you can store right there. Oh. Another neat thing, right in behind here, and the kitchen has one of these too, you pull this up and there's your phone charger and electrical outlet. So it makes that real convenient for any kind of power situation you need. Uh, didn't mention it on the outside, but this does have the uh, frameless windows. So it makes that look really, really sharp. 80% tin on them. Uh, also, this is an all weather four season coach. It has the enclosed underbelly uh, protected by the furnace. It also has uh, electric tank heaters. So that's gonna double help you in the cold weather, prote better protect your water. Uh, this camper does have two 15,000 BTU ducted air conditioners. So instead of a 15 and a 13.5, these are both the larger 15,000 BTU units and all thermostat controlled. Um, well, let's run up into the bathroom. Well, actually, before we do that, let's look at the lower bathroom. So right here, we do have a guest bathroom downstairs. So it's a half bath. You got your sink and your uh, residential porcelain toilet and then some more storage you can see in there and one neat thing about this door this door is fully open but it's hinged in the middle so people can still get by this door if you need it to so that's a really really nice and then right here in the hallway is our control system right up here is where you control that uh, tankless uh, water heater the water on demand and then right here this is our control for all of everything in the camper so you have a uh, little tablet here that you just go through and you can control the slides, the lights, check your uh, water levels, turn the uh, hot water, uh, well, turn the hot water on up there, but turn uh, the awnings, just about anything you want to do, you can do right here. It also comes, uh, there's an app on the smartphone, so your smart smartphone from anywhere in the camper can do the same thing. So a really neat system there. Up here in the bedroom, we do have a uh, king size bed so just a really large bed does have the an upgraded uh, really nice mattress here does have a ton of storage underneath it so you see all that storage and there's your vacuum hoses for the central vacuum system in here oh and then we have our uh, third tv so we have the tv outside and the living room tv and here's your bedroom tv and then tons of storage in here also just all kinds of storage. Now, we're gonna go into the main master bathroom. This is the biggest reason that this floor plan is so popular right now. This tub, this is re why we have to have that tankless water here. This is a huge tub. I'm six foot three, I can easily fit in this tub. It's one of the only tubs that I can actually fit in. Over here we have a his and her sink. And if you don't wanna take a bath, we have our standard shower over here that does have a bench. So just quite a bit in this bathroom. Uh, we even have a big tin bladed uh, exhaust fan up here, kind of like an attic fan. Uh, well guys, I was not able to get to everything on this camping trailer. There is just a lot to these Montanas. You can give me a call. You can call me toll free at 888-293-2211 and ask for Chris or just email me at the email address at the bottom of the page and uh, hope to talk to you soon. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.